Hello, Leo, and welcome to your reading. This is for Leo. Leo, you can now follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Rumble. And I will leave all of those links and all of that information down below in the description box. All right, Leo, this is for you. We're going to see what's going on. This is for Leo. This is for Leo. What does Leo need to know? Let's see. We have choosing a new direction. So go in your own way. Moving where you are feeling called to move. All right. Guided by the divine here. So let's see where this is going. This is for Leo. This is for Leo. What does Leo need to know? What does Leo need to know? We have deception. So someone in this equation is mm, not giving you the full story. Um, there's some falsity here. And I feel like you may be moving away from this uh, energy this this individual so you're being guided in a in a new direction here so let's get some more information this is for Leo what does Leo need to know we have pineapple reconciliation ooh does that not paint a picture? Does that not paint a picture? All right, so I feel like with these general readings, it, it could be a friend, it could be a lover, an ex-lover wanting to come back around. It could be um, a family member. It could be someone that you're working with, but their intention is not good. So you're, you're moving in a completely different direction here. And that is the, the, um, the advice for sure. So I feel like there's divine protection around you and you're being guided away from this energy, but it's, it's almost like a test. Um, they're going to come back around wanting to make peace with you, wanting to be in your life, but there is falsity here. There's deception here. And I feel like you don't trust this person anyway, and their intention is not good. Okay. Their intention is false. So let us pull some tarot on this and see where this is going, Leo. This is for Leo. What does Leo if this resonates with you, Leo, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a comment. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, Leo, please do check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign, as this will not resonate with every Leo out there. Cross watchers, please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa, interchangeable. This is for Leo. What does Leo need to know? What does Leo need to know? Let's see. Okay. Okay. There are still things hidden here. Um and the situation is going to get you all up in your head. Okay, when they when they do come back around, whether this is friend, family, coworker, whatever, it's it's they give you it's very nervous energy, a lot of anxiety, because I feel like you know this person's a little bit obsessed with the entire situation, and they do have some very toxic tendencies. They tried to hide that. I, I'm looking at this picture here, and my God, <laughs> look at that picture. Um, so 
it's it's fake it's false i see them you know giving you the flowers so let's say that's like a peace offering or you know trying to get your attention trying to make things better but there's still things hidden they're not showing a, you know enough to know that this isn't a good decision to reconcile with this individual uh, but there's so much more behind their mask it's not even funny there's so much more that you don't know. It's all illusion here. So you want to be happy, right? You, you want to have joy and happiness in your life. This is saying, hey, it's time to choose a new direction. So turning your back on the situation, I feel like you've been ignoring them. Um, anyway, Three of Wands here and looking towards the future. You want happiness? It's the future. Okay. You gotta cut ties with this individual completely. They're having they they may be struggling with that. But bottom line here, and be really blunt, this person is no good for you. Whoever this is, whether this is friend, family, lover, whatever. All right. Yeah, they put you in this state of huge disappointment. They themselves are going to um, express regret for what went down here, but it's their intention isn't good. Five of Cups. So your advice is to walk away walk away eight of cups here i feel like it's it's really it, like really important for you to do so because if you get caught up in this you're just going to end up feeling like this again that five of cups so they weren't it's like emptiness um you weren't getting what you need out of this person it was just very it, it became very empty and very draining so it's time to time to head out eight of cups here so i feel like you've had to take your power back i feel like i got the um, nine of pentacles here single lady card single person card and i got the queen of wands here this is all about you all right and your stability and you've really had to uh, be that uh, phoenix rising from the ashes and get get your life back together after dealing with this person it, they, they really brought your energy down to the point where you weren't even feeling like yourself their intention and this is just for a handful of you is to have some of what you have okay that could be um you know it, it's it, there could be a jealousy here um there could be uh, their intention may be asking you for um some monetary help that's for some of you, not all of you. But you look good, Leo. You look strong. And it's taken a while to get there. You look stable. And it's time to... It's time to detach from this energy. And experience... Um, experience all the new energy that the universe wants to give you. Alright? So... Queen of Wands here. This is you all day. You can be dealing with another fire sign or someone with fire in their chart. But this person's bra has, they have a way of bringing your confidence down, kind of stealing your energy, stealing your light. And you've had to kind of take your, take your power back and rebuild at the end of the day, this whole situation is up to you. If you want to, you know, revisit the situation with this person. 
you know, definitely could be family or someone that a friend that feels like family or someone that you've been in a commitment with or were in a commitment with. But you, you're starting to realize that you're not happy around this person. They are quite negative and deceptive. Ten of Cups here. So it's a very stressful situation. And when they do uh, make this peace offering to you, it's... It's difficult. It's going to get you all up in your head again with this um, Nine of Swords. So I feel like, you know, you're, you're going to think about, okay, can, can the situation improve? I feel like you've tried time and time again with this individual, but it always is this. It's, it's always this um, negative energy you could be dealing with the Capricorn. We got the devil card here. It's like this toxic obsessiveness, like this, uh, I don't know, codependency thing. Um, and their intentions are not true. This person will come in so sweet, so loving, so caring, full of regret and apologies, and there's still a hidden agenda here. There's still things you don't know that goes on with this person because the outcome is the moon. It's still full of illusion, full of secrets. You don't trust them anyway. You'd be dealing with a Pisces or somebody with Pisces in their chart. So, please clarify the moon for Leo. This is for Leo. What does Leo need to know? What does Leo need to know? So, it, they have a tendency to use people. That's what I want to say. And they have a tendency to watch people. And I, they, they're a bit obsessed here. So they're going to come back around trying to balance things, trying to be very generous to you, trying to show you, you know, care, be giving to you. But it, again... It is false. And I feel like your eyes are open and you're going to look into things before you make this decision. Let's pull one more card here for you. Why is the devil here? This person has a way, they, they're very um, intuitive, they're very charming. They're going to come towards you with a lot of love. We got the King of Cups here, we got the High Priestess here. But again, you're not getting the full picture. The pomegranate curtain hasn't fallen down. You can't see all the secrets that they have. You know enough to know that you cannot fully trust this individual. And you cannot get to a good place with this individual. They are full of secrets, this one. So, I feel like I need to pull one more card here. Very charming, though. Please clarify that page of swords. So... I feel like you're going to see, you're going to know more, but not everything. And I feel like you're full on in your power here. All right. You're the one that is kind of, you'd be dealing with an earth sign, by the way, or earth in their chart. I feel like, again, with the, the monetary factor here, are they looking at towards you for their stability? 
Is that what this is? You need to be careful here, Leo. All right. So, um, I just feel like the, the information that you already know about this individual, you cannot unknow it. And there's so much more going on behind the scenes and their intention, um, they're going to come at you so sweet and kind and loving and caring but it's not um, that's not their real intention here that's not the real intention I feel like you realize you can't you can't get back to a good space with this person just with the information that you know so your advice here Leo is to choose a new direction. Get away from this person. If you want your happiness, if you want your success, if you want to um, stay in your power, if you want to protect yourself and the things that you have built on your own, you cannot allow this person back into your space. It's, it's a very toxic situation, so. And again, whether this is a friend, a co-worker, a family member, or, an, or a lover, however it's resonating with you. But this is a, a bit of a warning for you that they're going to be coming back around wanting you, uh, wanting back into your good graces. So just be on your toes. All right. All right, Leo, that's what's going on. I hope that resonates with some of you, most of you, all of you. Like I said at the beginning of the video, you can follow me on uh, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Rumble. And I will leave all of those links and all of that information down below in the description box. You guys have a beautiful day and a great week. And I will talk to you soon. Take care. And God bless.